In the mid-60s, I used to drive these trolley buses in Nottingham. And that particular bus, the 514, I drove it many times. And uh, there's the overhead wiring. I used to do a U-turn there. And of course, my Indian conductor, Tilok Marhill, was a right stroppy little bastard. At that time, the fare from the city to Carlton was sixpence, two and a half p. How much is it now? Oh! And uh, at night, on the late shift, if drunks refused to pay, he used to start to fight. You fucking pay now! And the times I got the emergency bell, ding, 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 ding. I thought, oh God, not again. I had to go on and break it up. I used to say to him, don't start a fight over a sixpenny fare. If they don't want to pay, leave it. Wait till the inspector gets on and let the inspector deal with it. But no, in the, in the shift changes, we were always in the pub and I was always drunk. Uh, went round Canning Circus in Nottingham, mounting the pavement. Coming down from the city down to Carlton here, coming down Carlton Hill, high speed. <laughs> I got the bell for Garden Avenue, but by the time the bus stopped, passengers were at the bottom of Garden Avenue, and one bloke, he got off the bus and came up to the front, and I sat there. He says, You're fucking crazy, man! You're crazy! And at the depot, it was always the same. Driver Dale, report to Mr. Bunce's office. It took me off driving and put me on conducting, but being short of drivers, I used to end up back driving again. Pissed up as usual. I could use, I could drink in my younger days. I don't know, of course. Yeah, happy days. Someone, I put this on Facebook, and a Facebook friend sounds like said it sounds like an episode of on the buses, but they're good old trolley buses. Eventually, of course. They uh, scrapped them, and that particular bus, like all the others, are in a museum at Doncaster, which I must go up there one day. I must go up to see them, yeah. And they brought the Leylands in, Leyland and AEC, with the crash gearboxes, and uh, King Street at night. Oh, my hands aching, let me change. King Street at night used to pull away on this hill and of course crash gearbox the drivers uh, not only English the Indian West Indian Nigerian drivers didn't know how to handle crash gearboxes they'd pull away on the hill in first gear and then try to change into second <coughs> Well, I showed him how to do it one day. <coughs> Came to my turn and I was waiting to take over the 41 route to Cinder Hill. And they said, the oh, offer's going now. Let's wait to hear the crunch. I thought, well, I'll show you. So the bus were loaded, the top deck and the bottom deck. It, it were fully loaded and I pulled away in first gear in this Leyland. Just got the bus moving and snatched it back into second. Snatch change and pulled away, no problem, up to the top, to Parliament Street. That's what you had to do. Just pull away in first gear, once the bus were moving, just snatch straight back in into second, like slicing through butter. And uh, the driver said to me once, how do you manage that? I said, find out. Yeah. <laughs> Happy days. Let me stop the video. The old, tr uh, where am I going? Oh yeah, I've got to press that. Yeah, happy days, the old trolley buses in Nottingham. Of course, now they're one-man buses. Yeah, but those were the days, my friends.